Hi everyone, Seth coming to you from the Kenwood Training Department. Today we've got the Kenwood KAC-6407 4-channel Class AB amplifier. Class AB means it's a great combination of efficiency as well as performance, a great quality combination. Let's take a look inside the box. The first thing that you will notice is the included paperwork, the Kenwood warranty card, and the Kenwood instruction manual. Now we'll remove the packing material. Carefully notice that on the side there will be some included hardware. The included hardware bag. You will see that it does have some screws as well as the speaker level input harness. I'll go over that in just a few moments. Okay, now getting to the amplifier itself. Nicely redesigned for 2017. Maximum power output of 550 watts. This, described across four channels, gives you 60 watts by four RMS at two ohms and 40 watts RMS, that's continuous power output, by four channels at four ohms. Up above here, the Kenwood logo, and then the red triangle power indicator light. Now, I'm sure you've already observed all of the connections are on one side. Great for installation. Let's take a look. On the left, you will observe a 30 amp fuse. To the right of that will be your main power wire battery cable connection. To the right of that will be the remote turn on connection. And to the right of that is your ground cable connection. Next, you will observe at the bottom, it's labeled speaker A, left and right above. And then at the bottom again, speaker output B, looking above your left and right speakers. To the right of that will be your input sensitivity for your A and B channels. Now above that, you will notice some switches. The switch for channel A can be turned off, allowing all frequencies to pass through, or you can turn on the high pass filter, only allowing specific frequencies to pass through. To the right of that, the B switch selector can be turned off, again, allowing all signal to pass through, or you can turn the low pass filter on. This would allow you to use a subwoofer on the B channel. Turning the low pass filter on would then allow you to adjust the low pass filter frequency selector down below anywhere from 50 to 200 hertz. To the right of that will be your four RCA line inputs. And to the right of that, you will see it says speaker level input signal sensing turn on. When using the included speaker level input harness that we looked at earlier, you can connect that directly to the speaker leads in a vehicle. This is helpful when using a factory radio and then adding the Kenwood amplifier to the factory radio. This may eliminate the need for a line output converter. When connecting in this fashion, it will also turn the amplifier on as soon as those speaker wires detect an audio signal eliminating the need to run a remote turn-on lead in some vehicles. Well, we've looked at the outside of this amplifier. Haven't mentioned yet the cast aluminum heat sink design for great performance. This Kenwood amplifier has all the best sound quality components built into it for a great sounding stereo. The Kenwood KAC-6407 will be a great complement for any audio system upgrade. Thanks again for tuning in to the unboxing of the KAC-6407, and we'll look forward to seeing you again next time.